right? And then you have this situation where the HOA, you know, and you got the county doing nasty things with the land and people don't know how to protect their interest in their, their, their residential suburbia. Okay. And I was, I was suggesting that we use a homeowners association. And I know some of you at first thought are thinking, wow, if the county owns some property, how do you force the county into an HOA? First of all, the county's already in the HOA. <laughs> you just didn't define it yet. You just have to vote it in. So first of all, you define the community. That tells you who's voting, how many people are voting in what area. Then you have a majority vote according to your state law. Yes, according to your state statute. That's how you make an HOA. Okay. And then once you have that, you have the right to establish a lien, giving the HOA some power. And then you can write the rules for this whole community, including the county's property that you're trying to oppose. You can use an HOA to do these things.